so today's vlog of course is going to be a grocery haul vlog just trying to hurry up and get this one done fast because I have a lot of editing to do this weekend and it's just so easy for me to get this grocery haul vlog up every Sunday so this week was a big haul like a big haul it was not fun loading or unloading <laughs> some of it was just um impulse purchases but we had to like stock up on some diapers and things so I thought I would share it with y'all of course I think I have shared every grocery haul that we've had I always leave them in the description where you can go to the playlist and watch through all of them if you'd like I also have started using the Ibotta app for about a month now and I think I've got right at $30 back so I always have my referral link in the description and um, you can use my code and start saving money on any purchase but gonna show what we got so I'm literally standing back far as I can in my kitchen <laughs> just to show you all this but my counters are small but it's a lot so getting started we got a box instead of the bags this week since we were spending a little extra of um, Willow's diapers their training pants whatever and then I needed windshield wipers so I couldn't remember I had to look it up I needed a 22 inch and a 26 inch I've got to remember to get Michael to put those on for me when he gets home. This was so cute. I couldn't pass it up. And they were only 98 cents. These are little window clings. And they look vintage. And I just absolutely love them. I'm not sure if I'm going to put them on um, the window in the living room. Or in Willow's bedroom at Christmas time. But they were just too cute to pass up. So I got those. Just so adorable. Then I got this one. And stuff like this always sells out so fast when it's got like that vintage look and especially when it's only 98 cents and then I always kind of start with the non-food items this is the cutest thing ever I don't even know what material this is but it is so soft like it's softer than velvet and I wish I had something like this but it's so adorable again it looks kind of vintagey and it reminds me of some of the winter sheet prints that I've seen on like pottery barn and stuff but I got a 4t for willow and it was only $5.98 if you want to look up the item there's the info <laughs> but it's just a little long sleeve sweater thing and it's so comfy I think it's honestly it could be used for nighttime or daytime we're using it for daytime but so cute and cozy looking so I got her that one and then they had another little fall one in and I just love these for her to play with it doesn't matter if you know she gets or play in not play with <laughs> if she gets some stains or something I did get a 3t because some of the 4t's are still quite baggy on her but fit enough that I don't want to buy a lot of 3t so I just got her one of these for right now while it's slowly cooling off and I used my last of my fully cooked chicken in my last meal prep vlog. So I got two more bags. This will last me probably about six weeks or so, if not longer, because I just don't eat meat that often. And I got two packages of the Eckridge smoked sausage. We like the one in the natural casing. It just has a better flavor to us for some reason. And I think I want to do like a sheet pan of that with some broccoli or something. I'm not 100% sure what I want to do. It's, it's just I'm kind of trying out some things I guess um I did have I think it was five packs of mashed potatoes but Willow tore one open in the store so we have four packs I got two of the country buttered one of the four teas and one of the roasted garlic Michael lives on potatoes y'all he doesn't like vegetables that much so I make sure he always has a good amount of those some more of the reduced sodium bacon bits they had a little four pack of these for a dollar I got them for Michael he loves these as well um I haven't seen them in a four pack before though. I thought that was pretty cute. So I got him those. I saw this. I think this is something new and I'm laughing now because for whatever reason, barley and beans sounds hilarious. It sounds like a weird band name, but it's only 160 calories. And actually when I bought it, I didn't know I was in a hurry and I thought it was just tomato basil flavored and it was made big like a bowl where you could add something in. So I probably wouldn't have bought it if I'd known it had barley and beans in it because <laughs> that's just I don't know they don't sound super appetizing I'll eat it I'll just probably put it in like a salad now but I think that's new and then I got some sliced do you say Munster or Munster cheese I don't know I've heard people call it monster cheese got some of that <laughs> then I got a bag of these just because they looked really good I think I might actually roast those and the sausage with some broccoli or something one night then I got two of these apples, y'all. These, I wasn't even going to get these. These are Cosmic Crisp. But I don't know if you can even tell how pretty they are. They were just so vibrant and they're huge. So I had to buy it. I needed some fruit anyways. 
Got a two pack of cream cheese. I used to keep so much of this in the fridge stocked up and I, I, I don't know. I just don't cook with it as much anymore, I guess, since I started trying to lose some weight. But I want to make my pumpkin cream cheese muffin recipe I've been making for, I think, six years now. I think I'm going to do those next week. Um, so I need a cream cheese for that. Two blocks of the extra sharp cheddar. Extra sharp to me goes further because since it's stronger, you can use less. Got willow some blackberries because last week I bought these and within like a day I had to throw the whole container away. But these look good so I'm going to make sure she eats these today and tomorrow. Also these strawberries look really good. It's like hit or miss at our Walmart with our produce. A bag of the pecan halves. Um, I done those harvest grain bowls that I included on my meal prep. If you haven't seen that and I use pecans and that was so good. I'm definitely going to make that again at some point but... Just several things called for that, so I got some more of it. Got some more of the lo mein noodles to make homemade lo mein. I'm just hooked on making it at home now. I make it a lot. This is probably my favorite thing that I purchased today. It was so stinking cute, and I saw it from, like, way across the store. Thought it looked cute for Willow's room at Christmas time, and then I realized it said Jingle Those Bells, and y'all, she has been singing Jingle Bells nonstop for, like, two months because she's heard it on some cartoons and things. It was only $5.98. They had about three quarters of their Christmas stuff out. I'll probably vlog a little bit in store next week maybe just to show y'all what they had. We were running low on powder. I like this lavender chamomile one. It just smells really fresh. Kind of smells like a body spray honestly. And some feminine products, some cat litter. They didn't have the brand we wanted so I just grabbed something random. I'm trying out this sugar-free sweet tea. I have the bags where I can make it myself but I just kind of I rarely drink tea and I don't know I woke up this morning craving tea so I wanted to try something this is what I picked got one gallon of milk Michael will probably have to grab another gallon some point next week but we don't have room for a ton some lettuce I want to make like a um, chicken bacon ranch salad for lunch maybe tomorrow um, a big thing this is like the $20 pack I don't even remember how many rolls of toilet paper because I didn't realize how low we were and that's not something you want to run out of um, <laughs> I got Willow some more fruit cups. We have several appointments next week, and I want to make sure she still gets fruit when we're out, too. I wanted the Hawaiian sweet rolls, but they didn't have them, so I got the slider buns for that turkey that I'm going to cook tomorrow, actually. Um, oops. I'm cooking it, or baking it, whatever, for sandwiches, so I got that. I ran out of my pumpkin spice swirl bread. Y'all have seen me probably on here and Instagram eating this all the time. I love it and this is my third loaf. <laughs> Willow also eats it a lot of times when I eat it so I didn't think I was going to get any more because it stays out of stock. Managed to grab one. Got some rubber bands for Willow's hair. I've been using just like the bigger black ones but she doesn't keep bows in her hair so I thought that um, the colors were kind of cute. So she has something to match her outfit I guess. I don't know. <laughs> this super blend is what I use when I make the homemade lo mein. I just take like a good handful and toss it in the pan. I might actually share that recipe on like a short sometime soon because that's it's just so easy and I love it. Got these for Willow. She needed like a little cookie dessert something. We didn't have any. Um, these are for Michael. He eats Little Debbie snacks and stuff a lot. So I just got several to stock him up a little bit. Some celery. There's two things I need this for. Uh, cucumber we've just been buying one we were buying two but willow doesn't eat them as much anymore so i just got the one some pouches for when we're out or when she's just not really wanting to stop and sit still and eat bananas for her fudge rounds for michael <laughs> y'all already know every time i see the coke with coffee i get us one michael drinks the caramel one and i drink the vanilla zero sugar um, coke coffee one I got some hamburger dill chips. I've had a craving for like three weeks for fried pickles. And I think it's been like a year or two since I've had them. So that's going to be a little splurge at some point for me this week. We needed some Parmesan cheese. So I got one of these um, Italian style ones. I It's been a long time since I had this. So I can't remember if we liked it. I think we did. And then I got just the plain basic one. Another box of Nutty Buddies for Michael just to give him some variety. He won't eat all these in a week, but he'll have options. We need a toothpaste. We use the sensitive. We both have sensitive teeth. Mine are just excruciatingly sensitive, so I can't brush with anything else or it makes my teeth instantly hurt. So I got a two-pack. 
Willow loves these little dried fruit crisps. And y'all, I had to use the windshield wiper to reach this on the shelf because it was at the back. But I got my baby her snacks. <laughs> this was something interesting. I think this is new. I saw on the uh, middle aisle like where they had the seasonal baking stuff. So I love s'mores. I don't eat dessert a ton. I just kind of have little kicks with it. But s'mores is something that I love. So I will save that for some point when we want something sweet got willow some fruit and grain bars i got these um this was like four something because it's a little variety of snacks since we're going to be out so much next week and all i want to just make sure that i have enough that i can grab and go with she kept asking me for crackers which is what she calls these when we were on the aisle getting her diapers and pouches so i got some more of those teething wafer rust whatever <laughs> Also got some more of the Lipton. Um, this is the Diet Green Tea Pineapple Mango. This is on Ibotta again. I can't remember how much I got back, but I think it was anywhere from like $1 to $3 even. So um, definitely download Ibotta and you will save money on your groceries. So that is everything that we got for this week. So I'm going to keep it short and sweet and go ahead and end the vlog. Just keep it exclusively a grocery haul. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment down below for new and introduce yourself. It's really kind of neat to see the people that show up new and stick around. Um, as always, come back every Sunday, Wednesday, Friday, 5 p.m. Central Standard Time. That's my generally my time to upload. But I will say recently we have had so many um, <laughs> last minute appointments and things between. We, I had like eye doctor's visit. Michael had eye doctor's visit. Willow has several doctor's appointments between different places that she had to go and they all kind of fell at once. So when that happens, I try not to stress. I still record and vlog. It just takes me a while to get it edited. So I will always get my vlogs up at some point. But so far I have only missed, um, I think actually two of my 5 p.m. or one of my 5 p.m. uploads. And then I used to upload at 12 at the beginning of the year. And I have gone consistently from January up until October with only missing two uploads so I think that's pretty good I'm doing my best um but yeah don't forget to come back here on Wednesday I'm thinking Wednesday is probably going to be a day in the life vlog because I'm thinking I might start this evening or tomorrow even vlogging where I can kind of get a jump start on that so I think we're at like 619 subscribers which is insane I never even thought I would make 100 and it's pretty exciting I'm hoping that we continue to grow that's awesome um come back Wednesday at this point, you will have already seen the little home update. So, I don't know what our home looks like right now. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys on Wednesday's vlog.